Good morning. This is Lady P3, Pegula P3. I'm coming this morning. This is a marvelous Monday. It's another day to be grateful for. It's another day to be thankful that we are alive and well, have the faculties of our limb, and we're able to move about. What pressed upon my heart this morning is that so time, sometime through life, we are so busy doing everything for everybody. And we don't even take time for self-care to even see about us. So the scripture came to me with Psalms 46 and 10 that say, Be still and know that I am God. I am exalted among the nation and I am exalted in the earth. One passage say he'll be exalted among the heathen. Well, when we think about heathen, let's go this way. Let's go into this. It, we're working on us this month. It's not about nobody else. It's not about outside. It's not about who the enemy is trying to use against you. It's about you now. Focus on you. Focus on you. It's not about anything outside of you. It's all about within you. So go inside of you this morning and look you in the mirror. Those heathen thoughts that you have in your mind that tell you you'll never amount to anything. Those thoughts that tell you you're not worth the conversation. Those thoughts that tell you that you don't bring anything to the table. That's who I'm talking to this morning. I'm telling you to get the courage. Be bold enough to stand in your truth. And this say right here, this say be still. Be still and know that God is on your side. God is everywhere. There is not a spot that God is not. If you made your bed in heaven, God is there. If you made your bed in hell, he's there. Wherever you are, God is. What the Lord is saying to us on this marvelous Monday is be still. Get in meditation. Get in prayer. Get in solitude. Get in a place where you can rejoice and just know that God is. Sometimes we get so caught up on the cares of this life. And we're so co concerned about what other people think or how other people feel about us. A dear, dear friend of mine, an apostle friend of mine, she said something that kind of rocked my world. She said, Lady P, you got to get to the point. Well, you're not so concerned about what other people think about you, not what the church people think about you, not what nobody think about you. You got to get to the point where you care more about what you think about you. So I'm saying this this morning. It might sound redundant somewhat, but I'm saying it because somebody who needs to hear this will hear this. And if it resonates with you, take what resonates with you. If this is over your head and this is not for you, then let it go. You don't even have to pass judgment on it. Just say it's not for me. That's not my cup of tea this morning. But God is saying to us, be still. Quiet your mind and let the peace of God rule your heart. Be still and know that God is God and God is everywhere. Choose to be in the will of God because God have you in his will anyway. So choose to be in the will of God. I choose to make the day great. I choose to be who I need to be. So how are you showing up? So what I'm saying today on this marvelous Monday to you is this word here. Be still and know that God is everywhere. Be still and know that God is God. Love you. God bless you. Again, this is Lady P3 telling you to have a marvelous Monday if you can. Be blessed.